Hello guys, welcome to Love is Vacation YouTube's channel. Now I wanna give you information about 5 Best Places to Visit in the Provence Number 5 Roussillon Roussillon is a colorful place that is considered one of France's most impressive villages. It's situated in the heart of one of the highest ochre deposits in the world. You'll see impressive red cliffs as well as houses made from ochre that ranges from light yellow to dark red. Wandering through the streets here is a treat for the eyes. You can also take a walk through a former quarry to learn more about the mining process. It takes about an hour for the Sendier des Ochres or Ochre Path. Roussillon provided inspiration for many artists, including Jean Cocteau, so be sure to take in some galleries. Number 4 Arles Arles is Vincent van Gogh country. The Dutch artist created around 300 paintings and drawings of the city and countryside when he lived here in 1888 and 1889. You can walk the Van Gogh trail to see some of the scenes he painted. Arles also is a good place to see Roman ruins such as the stunning amphitheater that is still used today, and the Elysian fields where Romans were buried. You can climb to the top of the ancient arena for great views of the old town. The weekly market is considered in one of the best in Provence. Number 3 Gorge du Verdon Be prepared for stunning scenery when you visit the Gorge du Verdon, considered in one of the prettiest river canyons in Europe. The best place to view it is between Mstira Sandy Maria and Castellane where the gorge where, at almost 700 meters, 2,300 feet, the gorge is its deepest. The Gorges du Verdon makes a great day trip from the French Riviera. Once there, you can kayak down the turquoise blue Verdon River, hike through the gorge, or, if you have advanced climbing skills, do some rock climbing on the limestone formations. Number 2 Gourds from its strategic position on a plateau overlooking the Liberin, Gourdes is considered one of the prettiest villages in France. It's hard to argue with that, since picturesque grey and white stone buildings line the hill to the top. At the top you'll find a church and a castle. Be sure to check out the bones or little round stone huts that were used by shepherds in days of old. Another must-see is the Abbey of Sanank where monks make liquors and lavender essence. Peter Mailer's A Year in Provence is set here. Number 1 Avignon If you've always wanted to see where the popes lived and ruled, but don't want to fight the crowds at the Vatican, head to Avignon instead. Avignon was the seat of Roman Catholicism from 1309 to 1377. The fortress like Palais des Papas can be found in the old town, also home to a cathedral and other medieval monuments. This historic walled city attracts about 4 million visitors annual, with tens of thousands coming for the Festival d'Avignon, an annual arts festival that is the largest in France. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe.